And breaking this morning, Columbus police are investigating an early morning shooting that left two people dead. Thank you for waking up with NBC for today. I'm Matt Barnes. And I'm Monica Day. That shooting happened just before midnight on the city's northeast side. Matthew Herchik is joining us live from the scene. Matthew, what can you tell us? Matt, Monica, good morning. Uh, we know that both of the victims in this morning shooting are men. Police tell us that that first victim was pronounced dead here at the scene shortly after the shooting took place. The second was taken to the hospital in critical condition where they later died. But again, uh, as you can see behind me, still an active scene here this morning. A couple of more detectives just arrived here in the last half hour or so. And again, they're focusing their attention just beyond that crime scene bus. Uh, one detective did tell me both of the victims were found outside. So uh, that's just a, an update that we've received here in the last few minutes. But uh, we did have a crew on the scene here when the shooting happened uh, shortly or shortly after the shooting happened this morning. This is what it looked like then. Uh, details are limited, but police say that that shooting happened at 3262 Plum Creek Drive, and that's in the Garden Apartments complex. Now, police said officers pronounced again that first victim dead just after midnight. They have not released either of the victim's identities, but they tell us that they do have persons of interest in custody. They say they were arrested away from the scene, but did not say where exactly they were found. Right now, details on what happened and what led up to the shooting are still unclear. Now, guys, again, this is still an active investigation. We are still working to learn more as the scene develops here. As soon as we do, we'll bring that information to you both on air and online at NBC4i.com. Local for you in Columbus, Matthew Herchik, NBC4. Matthew, thank you. We'll continue to follow this breaking story as, the, as it develops throughout the day. To stay updated, download that NBC4 News app, scan the QR code on your screen, or search for NBC4 in your app store.